hallelujah everyone god bless each and every one of us again for joining family in the mighty name of jesus once more again it has pleased our lord and master savior jesus christ for the privilege that i'm here again to bring us god fresh words and in today's prophetic word title is talking about your b m a matches a royal family praise master jesus and this is shocking and the doctor that consult this test is, is in trouble because this is something that is about to cause a scandal right now in the realms of the spirit i know you were not expecting to hear this but this is not a word for you to screw i just want to plead with each and every one that we should watch and follow this amazing prophetic word from the beginning to the end and be blessed for in jesus mighty name we all know what we call dna right DNA is a test that is being conducted to show if you are the biological child of an individual in, at the point of which maybe there is doubt in the mighty name of Jesus. So, if this is your first time, family, God bless you. Hallelujah. They do not skip any single word, any single second on this prophetic video for in Jesus' mighty name. So, at the place of prayers, the Lord gave me this word talking about DNA. Hallelujah. And with my knowledge of God, one of the things that I've learned is that a lot of us has forgot our identity as Christian. We have forgot our identity as God's children. The Bible says in the book of, is it First John? First John, I think, if I'm not mistaken, the Bible says, okay, the Bible says, what manner of love the Lord has bestowed, the Father has bestowed upon us, that he has called us sons of God. If God is calling you a son of God, automatically you are like God a one from God praise master Jesus and the Bible said in the beginning was the word and the word was, was with God and the word was God the word comes from God and the Lord said let us create man so in the creation in the creation this God took his time to create everything praise master Jesus we have phones we have a lot of things cars we have a lot of things everything has a brand and it, and the brand is where it's been manufactured. Praise Master Jesus. So we are, I've never seen a company that manufacture men. I've never seen any company that manufacture this body. So when we are talking about the DNA, we have what we call the physical DNA, and there is what we call spiritual DNA. The spiritual DNA cannot be carried out by physical doctors because they cannot understand the mystery that is, that is going on in the realms of the spirit. The Bible says, God is holding the heaven and earth on his hand. All gold and silver belongs to our God. He is so rich. I just want to ask us this question. Just assuming and imagine you were the, the, the son or the daughter of, of the most richest man here on earth. I'm not going to call some names. That you have been living in poverty with your mother. Then at the particular stage, then they found out that your biological father is the most richest man here on earth and the man is coming to take you back you will be angry because you have been in poverty for so long not knowing that your father was this rich you'll be very happy even if you were not bold or courageous you'll be bold and courageous because you have known that your father is one of the richest man on earth you start eating in gold plate you start sleeping in golden bed you start taking private jet all over the world because the money is there just because you have identified who your real father is and your father has no choice rather than to love you provide for you because he is your biological father so what am i trying to say the bible says if men knows how to give good things to their children what more about god if a man know how to give good things to to their children what more about god so the lord ladies wanted me to speak to somebody wherever you're watching or connecting under the sound of my voice the lord says get ready do not be afraid. He is your biological father. You should never forget that he created you. The Lord see your identity. You should never forget that you are from him. He said in the book of Psalms 50 verse 15, Call upon me in the days of trouble, and I will answer, and I will show you great and mighty thing that thou knowest. What is your problem? What is that particular thing that you have been asking from God? What is that particular thing that is going on with your life? But I stand as a prophet of God. And I speak this word upon your life that in the name of Jesus, 
May you ask from your Father, and whatever thing that you ask from your Father, may your Father in heaven give it to you. May it be granted. Is it the marriage your Father has it? Is it the money, the connection, whatever thing? May you receive it. For in Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen.